Uh, this is another PHP tutorial. Uh, this is Spencer Williams. You can see me. The resolution on the camera is kind of crappy, and um, well, it is what it is. So let's go ahead and get started. Now, a few excerpts gonna be from this app called Programming Hub. You uh, download that from the uh, Play Store and everything. Download the. Uh, You'll open up the app and then you'll download the uh, PHP section of it. And you'll go ahead and proceed from there. Now, what we're going to cover in this one is uh, strings. <clears throat> so, let's go ahead and open this up. Now, you'll see we set the uh, SD variable to uh, live. Now, strrev function, that's string reverse. That'll reverse the order that the uh, that the characters are in. So basically, live is live spelled backwards is what this function is saying here. The variable spelled backwards, and we have that there. So that's gonna spell out live uh, backwards. Now we all now you also see we have the variable s1 in there, and that's equal to universe. Now universe has a space in it, so that'll count that as well. So that space is counted as part of that uh, variable. <coughs> and you'll see the echo statement echoing out the uh, S1 variable, length of S1. We'll concatenate that. And concatenation is the process of joining sh uh, strings with functions or variables. And it's done by a dot and then the function or the uh, variable you want to include in that. So the first and the uh, second end. Now the trim function you'll see here will remove the white space. So the space you see here in uh, universe there, see that? The trim will remove that. That's what the trim function does. So S1 is in there and S2 is equal to the trim version of S1. So what's the, so it's going to display nine characters in, out of this function here. And then it's going to display eight characters in this function here. And this is going to spell live backwards. So, pretty self explanatory. Now, before I go ahead and proceed, I have to let you know. I was going I was doing this one for the class person, was for the object oriented uh, <coughs> part of the uh, tutorial that I was trying to uh, cover and everything. I'm still working on it, so it's going to come up with errors. Just ignore those uh, PHP errors as those are on there intentionally. Because I want you to see what uh, PHP errors is going to pop up like. So let's go ahead and view this in the browser. Let's see? And comparing all that. Those are the errors. Now, this is the class destructor that says this person has passed away. So okay, and you'll see live is evil spelled backwards. Because evil is live or lives spelled backwards. S1 is equal to universe, but you're not going to see that white space there. The length is 9, like I told you. And then with S2 is equal to universe with the trim in it. So that's going to show up as 8 because it took out the space. And then space would count as the uh, character and everything. So <clears throat> let's go ahead and uh, go back. We'll see this here. Now, let me go ahead and uh, bring up the programming hub uh, app here. Uh, PHP programs that'll give you an outline of all programs all codes and everything that'll show you how to do it so you're adding numbers and this is how you would uh, uh, this is how you would do the uh, addition and uh, PHP and everything so it just gives you snippets of code and it sometimes they have a be uh, with it and everything now the ones I had gotten um, with string length and everything that'll show you up there <clears throat> and then the reverse string um, hello universe and everything I'll show you str rev and everything <coughs> so this is a pretty nifty tool to have during your uh, career and everything if you uh, now give you everyone to look at your uh, PHP um, code and everything like that um, this is what we'll uh, go ahead and take a look at but these are PHP programs just kind of put in to show you how the syntax would go to do it properly. So, uh, 
that's basically oh add. nicely done but these are uh but that's pretty much how you would handle the uh string and everything the string functions now there are more but i'm going to leave that up to you to use your imagination and investigate and everything so leave you with a bit of homework give me all the uh string functions you can use now you're welcome to do this you don't have to if you don't want to but i, w I just want you guys to go ahead and uh learn more to self-teaching and everything too so again my name is Spencer Williams and I want to thank you to uh, I want to thank you for being a part of this uh, PHP tutorial and you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend